hey y'all what's up welcome back to my channel it's your girl Aisha G and if you're new here make sure you like comment subscribe if you're not welcome back and thanks for watching my video so as you can see your girl feel official okay look look at the logo look at me you know and over here just say I just feel official like you know anyways so now that I have all of that, I can go and start talking to businesses, trying to get my machines into a business or trying to pro provide a machine for them. I'm really targeting places like motels, hotels, construction sites, office buildings, um, new buildings, small buildings, any buildings, okay? Any buildings with a lot of traffic as like hotels and motels and stuff like that. That's what I'm trying to get into first. So... Right now, I'm at this Motel 8. I'm at a Motel 8 or whatever. And um, I walked in to talk to somebody. And as soon as I walked in, it was a whole bunch of vending machines already. And I, and I actually saw a smaller one. And it had like um, toiletry items like razors and deodorant and lotion and all of that. I was like, okay, that's a good idea. Like, I can also do that. Not only do it, can I provide the snacks and the drinks and stuff but i can also do toiletry items to people that may be traveling or forgot something don't feel like going all the way back to the store and stuff like that so that's a good idea once i saw the vending machines already there and set up it's about four of them so i was like it's pointless for me to even go in there i didn't even talk to anybody um because you know if it was maybe one or two i'd be like oh yeah let me i can still talk to them but it's four in here. They don't need this place is not that big for another vending machine, so I ain't even waste my time. But that ain't, that's not gonna stop me. I'm gonna keep driving around the city looking for. It is hot out here too, y'all. It is hot. It's hot today. I really don't have a method. I'm just really driving through the city and stopping wherever I see it. And this method is called driving for dollars. Okay, and I learned this from the ebook look this lady i just uh, that's what i want let's watch this lady walk from her room to the office to get a soda from the vending machine that's that could have been my soda that's what i want i'm trying to get to that <sighs> one day y'all we working on it we working on it keep hope alive um yeah i'm gonna keep driving and you know i'm gonna keep trying i'm not gonna stop and hopefully i get at least to talk to somebody or you know i'll keep y'all updated of course See you later. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. I'll keep y'all updated on the process. Bye-bye. Hey, what's up, y'all? It's your girl, Aisha G. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome back. If you're not, thanks for watching again, honey. All right, y'all. So as y'all can see, I have my shirt on. Over here, it says my name is CEO. Over here, it has my company logo and my company is treat yourself goods and services for those of you that don't know if this is your first time watching my videos i'm gonna go ahead and give you this update okay so let me just run it through real quick my name is aisha g i am a young entrepreneur from houston texas i have a vending machine company it's called treat yourself goods and services make sure you like us on facebook follow us on instagram and i'm in the houston area if anybody needs vending machine vending machine services absolutely free to the business i provide candy machines soda machines and snack machines and also toiletry machines too because you know hey we need those too any type of machines that you would like for your business i can provide those for you just contact me i will put my social media accounts in the description so if you would like to work with me just hit me up all right so today it's hot in here so today i am looking for locations still um today i'm looking for locations so i'm gonna bring you guys with me when i go into these locations to see if they need vending machines hopefully you know i talked to somebody that says yes because yesterday i worked all day and i went to so many locations and everybody was like no 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 see I think it's because the time that we're in, of course, everything's closed because we're um, supposed to be quarantining and staying out of sight and stuff. But this money got to be made. I keep my Germex on me at all times. Um, I wear gloves and I just have to be safe. But baby, this money not going to make itself. 
it's not try to be safe and sanitize everything as much as i can but we got work to do okay so i'm gonna take you guys with me i'm gonna right now i'm at this like office area this like office building and it has a big rent sign like on the outside so i'm gonna walk in and just ask to speak to the property manager and just go from there i have oh let me show y'all my what i made so these are my flyers that i made it has my logo at the top it has a little bit about my business it has the type of machines that we offer it has my logo at the top it has a little bit about my business it has the type of machines that we offer it also has my contact information at the bottom and it just tells people that we want to serve them i also have my treat yourself um goods and services business cards there's a front and a back and on this it gives you so much information about the company and how to get in contact with us so I'm gonna take this with me inside um, and I'm gonna just go talk to them most likely they probably will say no but it's worth a try so let's go all right so I forgot to tell y'all not only Oops. okay so I forgot to tell y'all Okay, so I forgot to tell you, not only did she was not only did she say, yeah, we actually do need vending machines, she was also like, I have another location. Can do you also travel to this city? I'm in Houston, but she was like, Do you also travel to Pearland? And I was like, Yeah, Pearland is not that far for me to say, no, nah, I ain't about to go make no money. What? Yes, I traveled to Pearland also. Would you like me? She was like, because I have a um another location there, another auto collision um repair shop. I'm like, okay. Yes, ma'am. Fact that this is not no little location. Like, this is not no little brain, no little brain like spot. This is uh you see commercials. This is a well known all over the nation spot. Like, I thought that when I went inside, that I would have had to like, oh, you have to call corporate and you have to call you know this big person and they'll let you know. But nah, I just walked in and she was like, yeah, I do. I said, okay, girl okay i'm excited about that okay so now i'm at these apartments i'm like i think the leasing office is closed so what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna take i'm gonna take my flyer and i'm gonna take my business card and i'm just gonna like stick stick it in the office's mailbox or under the door or something just i just want them to make sure i just want to make sure they get it i don't know if they don't get it somebody gonna get it okay i'll take either or Baby, it is getting hot in Texas. We in what? April? Oh, okay. It's, it's about that time. It started getting hot anyway. This whole clothes. So I'm gonna just put this in here. Okay. Because. Hold on. Okay. Ooh, I struggled with that, honey. Struggle. Ooh, I'm about to go. See, that made me want to go. I went to one auto collision repair shop and she said, yeah. That made me want to go to all the auto collision repair shops. See, that's crazy. I ain't even think about going to them. I ain't even think about going to them because I'm like, it ain't, they don't really, I mean, they be having customers, but customers don't be like just sitting in there all the time. Focus. Y'all saw that? Whoa. Let's wrong. Stop acting crazy. Do I need to wipe my lens? See? Okay. See? But yeah, so. I'm about to go to a few, okay? Cause I hate when this camera do this. Like, like just focus, like focus. It's 2020, focus, dang. Okay, no, but for real. 
So guys, um, just went to this tire shop or whatever, and I talked to this dude, and he told me, um, you know. So he said that his, um, I guess his business partner is also working on a different shop right now, and he was like, he'll, um, you know, let his business partner know, and then maybe they can get me to put vending machines into the loca their locations. These, I mean, stuff like this, it makes me feel good, but at the same time, you can never. It's always a good feeling when somebody says yes. But the thing about it is, I hope y'all can hear me. Let me turn this off. It's always a good feeling when somebody says yes. The thing about it is somebody saying yes and somebody actually actually putting in the work and the effort to actually do what they said is two different things. They're two different things. Somebody can say yeah all the time, but then when it comes down to it, ain't nothing going on. So I'm like, you really just told me yeah for no reason. But that's the name of the game. Like that's how the game goes. You just got to get it and roll with it i don't ever want to just say oh is she just saying yeah she just saying she'll let me do it because sometimes people really be real same time i never want to get my hopes up and count some money you know i never want to put all my eggs in one basket and say oh okay well i'll just she said yes i'm just gonna wait on it i'm not gonna do nothing else no 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 no. this show do not stop on no yes baby you gotta show me Show me. I'm not stopping until I get my machine in your business. And then after I get my machine in your business, I'm still going to be trying to get other locations. All while I'm all while I'm still taking care of your location. You know what I'm saying? We all going to eat. All going to eat. And I ain't going to slip. Period. <laughs> all right. But I'm going to some more places. I'm about to roll down the street and see what I see. And that's where I'm going to stop at. So... I'll keep y'all updated. Bye.